Cardi B opens up about her infamous fight with Nicki Minaj and reveals what exactly sparked it. Plus, Nicki was noticeably MIA from the American Music Awards, and we know why. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life, and Cardi B hit the American Music Awards stage to perform her epic track, I Like It, alongside J Balvin and Bad Bunny, and the crowd loved it. She also won Favorite Rap Hip Hop Artist, and in her acceptance speech, she thanked her baby girl for a pretty inspiring reason. Thank you, Jesus. And I really want to thank my daughter. And not just because she's my daughter, but while I was pregnant, I was just so influenced to be like, Yo, I gotta do this. I gotta show people wrong. I gotta prove people wrong. Cause they said I wasn't gonna make it after I had a baby. And my husband, hey husband. Mm. Now when it was her husband's turn to accept the award for favorite pop rock group, why are Migos in that category? Cardi was super giddy, so note to self, get yourself someone who supports you like Cardi supports Offset. Speaking of Migos, Quavo confirmed they're working on Culture 3 to Billboard, and also he talked about being an uncle to Culture. She with the fam, we with the gang, and we we all love each other, we, 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 the, we the wave. How is it to see Cardi and Offset as parents right now? I love seeing that beautiful couple, power to the couple. On to Nicki Minaj, she was noticeably absent from the award show, so looks like all that drama about her coming face to face with Cardi for the first time since their fight was for nothing. Well, TMZ is reporting Nicki flew into LA for the award show and was actually getting ready just hours before until a production source revealed she was never at any point scheduled to appear. Weird. But all right, on to that infamous Fashion Week fight. Cardi spoke to W Magazine and revealed what exactly sparked the brawl, saying, for a while now, she's been taking a lot of shots at me. I spoke to her twice before and we came to an understanding, but she kept it going. But what really set Cardi off was when Nicki apparently liked and then unliked a tweet that talked about Cardi as a new mom and her parenting skills. Cardi told the mag I was going to make millions off my Bruno Mars tour and I sacrificed that to stay with my daughter. I love my daughter. I'm a good ass effing mom. So for somebody that don't have a child to like that comment. So yeah, that's when she decided to confront Nicki and throw her shoe to emphasize she isn't messing around. Now, whether or not it was the right occasion, Cardi said so many people want to say that that party wasn't the right time or place, but I'm not going to catch another artist in the grocery store or down the block. She's got a point. Like, she's not going to catch Nikki at Trader Joe's. I mean, maybe Whole Foods. But all right, click the sub, like, and bell button, and let us know what you thought about Cardi's AMA performance, and follow me on social media at Ali Segnita for my reaction. Bye, guys.